On the morning of Sunday, November 17th, a large storm system ravished the Midwest area. The storm system ripped through Illinois, creating a series of 17 tornadoes. The storm created an unbelievable amount of damage and was at its worst in Washington, Illinois, near Peoria, where an EF3 tornado destroyed the entire area. As the storm moved northeast, heading for Chicago, the Chicago Bears had just kicked off in the hazardous wind and dark skies. Midway in quarter one, the Soldier Field staff evacuated the fans to the concourse levels of the stadium to wait for the dangerous storm to pass. The game was delayed for almost two hours before the Bears defeated the Ravens 23-20 in overtime. Meanwhile, the people of Illinois have a long road to recovery ahead as some people's homes are completely gone. On Sunday, I didn't realize the weather was particularly bad. I know I was sitting in my room and I just looked out the window and it was pouring all of a sudden. Um, but I didn't realize how bad it was until my mom texted me and was like, oh my gosh, are you okay? How is it going over there? And I was like, yeah, it's fine. It's just kind of rainy. And she said, um, you're supposed to have like 60 mile an hour winds. Um, so that was kind of a wake up call for me because I was not aware. And um, then she was talking about how there was a semi truck in St. Louis where she lives that had been completely flipped over by the wind on a bridge. And miraculously, it stayed on the bridge, but that's just like crazy unimaginable. Um, and then I have friends in Washington, Illinois, where it hit the hardest, and they were lucky. Their house is still livable. It's just seriously damaged, but she has a lot of friends, and they, you know, their church has major damage because we had to move out and fix up their house first, so it was intense. Six deaths have been confirmed so far as a result of these tornadoes. Search and rescue operations are still in effect, and many hope that the death toll does not rise. For WCGR News, I'm Alex Pat.